y'all. What's up, y'all? Back on the 520. So, earlier today, I recorded the riding video on the 300. And, uh, but after I ended that, I got the 300 and it wouldn't crank. The battery was dead. So, I don't know about that. The battery's fairly new. Definitely gonna have to get that checked out. I don't know what's wrong with it. It's not the first time it's done something like that. My four wheeler hits red limiter at 53. Washed 
out so freaking bad. I'm about to dust this cow. Watch this.
that's gonna have to be fixed because that's definitely a power line. I think it is. I don't know. It may not be because that thing looks pretty thick for it to be a power line. Let's see if I can see if it's raining out over here. What does it go to though? I think it goes to a pole right up in there. I think it, it must be a deadline because there's no power out and all the lines are right up there. So I don't know. I don't see any doves on the power line. There's normally all kinds of doves on that power line, and it's the middle of June. Which September's coming. I think that's when dove season opens for us, September. Yeah. I'm not a big dove hunter, but I will go like once a year. Came through here on the 300 earlier. She was absolutely destroying this mud. Can't be 300. I'm gonna go through it this way. I think this is the bad part over here. And yep, I'm already stuck. Am I gonna have to put it in four wheel drive, dude? It's hard to film. And channel if you're new let's get us a nice shot of the foreman real quick here anyway thank y'all guys for watching and i will see y'all in the next one